too heavy. Give me a hand. I bet this water is drinkable. <laughs> you want to try it? Uh, I think I'll stick to the bottles you found in the cargo from the plane. If I had known how much time I'd spend in the wilderness, I'd, I'd have paid more attention in Boy Scouts. <laughs> Wasn't your thing? Well, my family situation meant we didn't get to do a lot of stuff like that. <laughs> what about you? Ever do Girl Scouts or Nature Camp as a kid? Hmm, does boarding school count? <laughs> I don't know. Does it? <laughs> Probably not. But Roth showed me some things. I always prefer the company of adults anyway. <sighs> yeah. I miss that guy. Me too. Hey, that did something. I think the water powers the bridge somehow. With Eli gone, your arm should heal quickly. Yeah. I feel a lot better already. Guess we go through here. After you. What's that? I think it's some sort of stealer or... Help me with this. Sure. What is it? It's... A recipe seems to be a mixture of herbs. It could help if we run into any more jaguars. <laughs> Let's hope we don't. Way out is over here. We're getting closer to the village. I can't wait to get back to civilization. This 
are different from the ruins in Mexico. <clears throat> Your dad's notebooks say anything about Peru? No. I mean, there is supposed to be a secret city of gold in Peru. Paititi. Every treasure hunter on Earth is looking for it. But dad's notes stop in Mexico. Like he lost interest, or... Or? I don't know. The next volume picks up in Syria. I think we can get out that way. Jonah, help me with this. On three, two, one. Oh! 